What's up basketball fans? Welcome back to Time Out. Back with me Rocky Padilla and today, look who's in Jakarta back in town. Uncle Rob Mario Busa. Hey, Rob. Good to see you man. So, the big news today. You guys more tahu ya. Ini mix saya bahasa Inggris bahasa Indonesia. Um, everybody knows that you're coming back to Zuhai Wolf Warriors in the ABL, a new team. So, we met in July in LA. You know, your retirement. What happened between July till today? <laughs> Now, a lot, a lot happened. So, uh, you know, well, I mean, I, I finished off with my um, CLS and actually I had, a, I had another year of my contract. Both sides uh, chose to go our separate ways. You know, I mean, I was I was content with retirement. You know, about four months ago. But honestly, you know, that, that not really how I wanted to end my basketball pro career. Um, so I was chilling, man. I was just chilling, having having a good time, spending kind of family time, chilling. And then, uh, I get a call from a team in China, and this opportunity came, and you know, everything looked good. And, You know, I, 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 thought, I thought about it, talked to my family about it, and it's like it's a good opportunity for me to kind of retire on my own terms and, and, and walk away. You know, just coming to the situation open-minded and, and enjoying one last season and just having fun, man. So, but can you describe like how do you want to retire like on your own terms, right? Can you describe it? Well, I mean, you know, just just knowing that I'm gonna finish off the season. Kind of having my mindset as as uh, just being 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 blessed to, to have this last season and doing everything I can to help this team and, and just being a good good, good uh, situation. So I saw you in China already, right? So did you get a chance to work out with the team already? I I, had, I, I went over to China to, uh, to just evaluate the situation and the team and stuff like that. And I didn't work out with them, but I, I got to know some. Guys, and it's, you know, these guys are. It was good. They made, they welcomed me with open arms and showed me love. It's a good situation. So, any expectations for this upcoming I that almost as I do, but ABL season. Well, I mean, you know, uh, for me personally, I just I want to come in there with an open mind and just do whatever I can to help this team um, succeed. My experience, my knowledge in that aspect, and just compete and have fun, man. You know, it's it's a blessing, man. I, I'm still healthy and I still have passion for the game, so it's, I just want to come in there and have fun. As far as the team, I know they're a new team, you know, um, so we're going to do everything we can to try to be successful. Um, you know, I don't think we're, we're, we're going to talk about targets or goals right now, but you know, we're, we're going we're to work. So that means you're going to be a wolf, big boy. Is there any any pressure? You just you know, not man. You know what? Maybe if I was 25, there is. You know, I mean, if you want to break it down, basketball in any position, in any in any situation, in professional basketball, there is some pressure. But me at this stage of my career, I mean, I'm, I'm coming in a situation. They they want me over there, uh, you know, to help them out and everything like that. And the feeling is mutual for me. Um, so I'm happy to come in there with the help of mine, man. I don't think there's any crazy out of the ordinary pressure. So you know, I'm gonna enjoy it. What does it mean though to you, as a 39 years old now? I think the first Indonesian to be ever a world to be a world import. What does it mean to you? To I your mean, career? I mean, I don't really, you know, it's I have that that hasn't even said it yet. But um, guys, it's cool. It's, it's, it's a blessing. Like I said, it's a blessing. And you know, I'm I working hard throughout my for my career. This. So, um, yeah, I, I think it's kind of a testament to this dedication you know, and, and it's a blessing. You know, I, I think young guys can look at that. If they look at it from a, from a positive perspective, they can, they can learn from that. So, it is a blessing. So, Uncle Rob, good luck. Appreciate that, man. <laughs> We just finished working out, so top of my top and really tired. So, good luck, stay healthy. Looking forward to see you play. Yeah, I'm so happy he's coming back because I told him to stay one more year. 
and it happens. <laughs> so don't forget to support Uncle Ro this upcoming season. And don't forget to follow his Instagram at Real Rosico. Is that right? Hey, yeah, that's right. Can, can I say something, Rock? Man, I just want to say to Indonesia, to all of all, everyone that supported me in Indonesia, all my fans, and whatever, it's all love, man. You know, I, I, I've always, I've always gonna, I'm always gonna keep a special place in my heart for this country, in Indonesia, and the fans here, and that's always supported me since, since I got here in 2003. And um, you know, whatever I do outside of Indonesia, whatever team I play for. In a way, uh, I hope I can represent you guys uh, in, in a positive way. So I'll uh, say that, share that with y'all. It's all love. I'm pretty sure everybody gonna support you, man. Don't worry about it. We all know the history. <laughs> so guys, don't forget to like and comment what you think about Ro coming back. And don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you guys next video. Peace.